Okay, hi ladies. I'm so super excited. I received finally my first diamond painting. I'm so super excited because I wanted this for so long. So my package arrived and I opened yesterday just to check if everything's okay so I can give my review to the owner, who sell, to the salesman who sold me this. So let's see what we got here. I ordered, <coughs> excuse me, I ordered three pictures and different sizes. I'm going to tell you what sizes I have. Uh, first, I'm going to show you the one we opened yesterday because uh, my little girl, she just couldn't wait anymore. She wanted to try so badly. So I'm going to show you that one first. Very tiny one. Look at this pretty unicorn. I don't know if it's glare. Can you see good? Look how cute. So we opened and she started to do yesterday some she placed a whole bunch of gems already. Super super cute. So this one size is 16 by 16 centimeters, which is very tiny. And Together with this, <clears throat> and I just spill it. Okay, hold on. Okay, so everything was packed uh, very nicely, and then they give uh, empty bags, which I'm gonna show you here. So we separate it, and I just cut uh, numbers to put in each bag so I know what it is came with this pen and a little tiny like a silicone glue so you just open a little bit piece in here like plastic and you just stick it and the silicone will go here and it's easier to pick up and place gems also came with tweezers in case if you place the gem on a wrong spot then you can pull it out Okay, little tray, and I just, I see, spill some in here. Okay, let me quickly fix my mess so I don't make it more. Hold on, oh, you know what, I'm just going to put this aside like this and fix it later. After I'm done with this video. Okay, let's see what else I got. And I'm telling you, if you never did this before, you might not want to start. Otherwise, you're going to be addicted so badly. <laughs> so this um, says diamond, diamond painting brings pleasure into your everyday life. So this one size is 24 by 24 centimeters. So <clears throat> if you know me very well, I like anything shiny, which um, some packaging just they just wrap uh, this out box. I like this salesman. They um, it was pretty nice wrapped in, in the boxes, which your main pictures and safe from being banned. <clears throat> I'm gonna show you this one. So yeah, if you know me, you know me. I love flowers. And this one, look at us. Okay, that's so gorgeous. Look at this bouquet of poppy flowers. I love poppy flowers. So just so you know, if you never worked before with this, like for example, I'm gonna show you how clearly you can see uh, all the numbers and letters which is very easy to follow some pictures i said before youtuber share that is so dark and smudgy that it's really hard to follow pattern to put gems and this one looks really good so what we have here let's see i see nice and pretty look at those pretty gems i assume this is go for a center of the flowers and these gems are so tiny <clears throat> so 
sorry for the noise of this paper it's always making lots of noises so here you go look at this pretty pretty gems so we have here one two three four five six centers and look how many they send one two three four five six and three extra they always ship some extras no matter what <clears throat> i see many girls not many actually but some complaining that not enough gems i don't know if that's the um of the square bigger size because this one is round one i thought i ordered square but i might be mistaken but this is how they come in this kind of long strips you see that lots of colors and what i do well in here what we have is this package seriously i need my coffee because otherwise i lose my voice so with each picture you receive in this tool to place your gems and i'm gonna show you the difference okay you see this tray oh this one has uh, stickers so you can put numbers and stick to your zippy bag they sent you zippy bags which is awesome to uh, when you open this package and then you just put them on a zip bag and you're not gonna spill them or nothing uh, because this little picture didn't have um, the little picture with unicorn didn't have the stickers so what I did you see that every baggie has a number like this 11 12 and on and on so what I did I I cut I put in a zip bag then I cut it out number of the beads and then I put inside the zip bag so that way I kind of I know what number I have so that was this little picture this bigger one they put stickers you can just stick right on a zip lock and put number of the beads so that's good stuff and just so you know they always ship you extras so you're not gonna run out i'm gonna show you an example of this little picture i'm already finished here with some um, which color hold on let me see i already okay here I already finished with this colors for the uh, unicorn picture and you see how many how many beads still left over tons you can put another picture so I'm telling you that they ship with lots of extra beads because some tiny beads could be damaged little holes I see uh, or um, just not perfect so that's why they always put some extra so you can kind of pick the best one and the rest of you can just toss it or keep it for some other your project so that's awesome right okay so that's the picture and as you see even because of the bigger picture you see how different size of this glue silicone so even this one piece gonna be enough for me to do all three pictures because you need just a little tiny bit you just open a plastic I don't know can you see it stick the pen on a glue and just go right inside this hole and you're good to go so okay so this is what we have here let me just put this back so I don't mix up them okay and yeah tweezers two in each package supposed to be so let's see let's put this one on the side this one was 24 by 24 centimeters and my oh my god sorry my floor is squeaky now we have here my biggest picture that i ordered this one looks gorgeous and i'm telling you this is so addicting seriously girls if you don't want addiction stay away from this stuff okay so this one is 40 by 40 centimeters which is pretty big and let's see if i can show you move this away 
Need more room in here. Okay. Let's see this beauty. So yeah, last night um, I opened them just to make sure no damage or nothing because I have to leave a review and um, on their site and just tell them that I receive everything is good, no dispute, no nothing. So let's see this picture. This one looks gorgeous. Okay, let me find a, where's the bottom? Okay, here's the bottom. Look at this pretty. Oh my God. I am so excited to start on this teeny picture. Okay, I'll to show you better. Look at this. And I really, really want to find some other seller that sells uh, not uh, plastic gems, but glass from clear um, resin, I believe. So with this one, same story. We got a uh, tweezers tray with the silicone glue. Also has a zip bag to put bits inside and a stickers for the numbers. Cool. And oh my God. God, guys, look at this, all the color. I'm just so excited about this color. This pink and purple lila is, oh my God, look at this bag, guys. It's tons. And I'm telling you, it's gonna be tons left over probably because, okay, and the table will be see better. Look how many gems. I'm gonna be in heaven. See lots of colors the same, I think. Yeah, six. Oh no, this is six or nine, this is six or three, so slightly different, I guess. Um, yeah, they are full, full with beads, so I'm sure it's gonna be uh, more than enough. And colors is gorgeous. It doesn't seem like they really kind of shiny till you put on a picture and then you can see all this. Um, size that's kind of shimmery and pretty and here's that close-up picture you see how uh, as well you can see all the numbers lines so it will be easy to follow and um, this side you need to there's a little sheet in here that you peel and when you peel this is like really really sticky so when you work with this kind of pictures, you make sure you open little by little square. Maybe I'm not even cut, but I'm going to show you how I did on this little one. Um, I was working because it's very important not to get any dust. Or if you have a pads, they would be like first sticking to the glue underneath this protective sheet. And the gems eventually not gonna be sticking very well. So I just like cut the sheet, for example, here a little bit. And then I just kind of peel it slightly and go like, just peel it and hold it like this. And then I stick a colors. Uh, I just do by the colors, for example, this brown one, I don't know what was the number, uh, I think it was number two. So I'm just put on a tray, a little bit of beads, and stick this corner, then I close back, and then I kind of peek a boo, open the other side a little bit, and stick again. If you like to line up all those beads, uh, like on a different little trays, and just do by row, but for me, it would be... The, Probably not comfortable. We cannot, she, my daughter started yesterday from the bottom because it's more like a lighter and then we kind of go up, up. But uh, as you see, all the corners, it's almost done. Really left unicorn to do. So she told me today, mom, you can do it. I give you permission because we're gonna do the other ones together with you. And you know, I thought like she's nine years old and I thought she will be bored really soon. But oh my gosh, she did such a good job and she's doing it so perfectly straight. Look at those lines. She did so good job. So this is her first diamond painting gonna be. 
and it's so easy to do guys so easy to do uh, when you get hanger and I think this kind of diamond painting would be good for people I would say for people with anxieties for to calm them down because it's such a relaxing job to do this and I really really enjoy this so if you like stress or you some kids uh, have anxiety and you know that the feeling that they don't know what to do with themselves so I think this is the best thing to do give them to to do this kind of craft and it's really really relaxing and it's so enjoyable to see what will come out on the end and I really look forward to these big pictures so obviously let me just see the size of the beads if they differ because uh, the little painting that uh, has 16 by 16 centimeters is really tiny so I don't know can you see the difference on the size of the focus I think they almost the same I don't know maybe a little bit bigger I have to figure out that <clears throat> but anyway I really look forward to make this picture it's gorgeous isn't it I love it I love it so yeah thanks for staying with me and I will show you maybe later a little bit more video process how I'm doing it and uh, what's gonna be come up on the end and uh, you just need to make sure to keep this protective sheet until you finish or after you finish uh, it's good to put actually in a frame with the glass so dust doesn't stick to your pictures with the time because even if you put gems there's a little spaces between them and it's still sticking you can see it shining it will stick any dust or pet fur so make sure your area is clean while you're working in the first place and i even thinking maybe later i will try even sprinkle on the top with some like a clear type of glitter to fill up those spaces so it will be more shiny but i don't know if that's going to be a good idea or not because it could be ruin colors tones underneath those gems because you still can see the lights dark and glitter maybe just gonna be like even up color so I don't know about that yet but that's the idea this is gonna be pretty pretty unicorn for Catherine and thanks for staying with me guys I hope you enjoy my unboxing that was my first diamond painting unboxing and next time I will try to order something that has a jemmy gems like a glass gems oh I love that and they are square and more fill up the spaces properly and just gorgeous looking much more sparkle which this one is sparkly too I think it's pretty sparkle so little example here I still have a sheet yeah I love it you see how it's sparkle it's still beautiful okay guys make sure you subscribe like and you know let's craft together and be happy because together we make this world more beautiful okay see you next time bye bye